like to scoot in. Hi. <laughs> We're having a little technical difficulties. Welcome to Kids Art Tour. I'm Miss Rebecca. Welcome to Kids Art Tour. So we're just gonna wait around till people come and don't reveal our new tech. We have a new, <laughs> we have new technology that is enabling our camera to be somewhat it's invisible. Called, it's, it's not what we're getting. It's called green paper. Oh, and then I realized <laughs> I actually need to plug this thing in. So mm -hmm. we just may fall apart here. We it'll, may fall apart. It'll be like this invisible cord that goes up to cow. But it's not invisible. And I just like to say, boy, we are together. We we're gonna be together. With it. Um no. <laughs> and I have to figure out where this is gonna get plugged in. So while you're waiting. <laughs> that <was> really weird. <laughs> I know I was like trying in my head to figure out like can I put it up through the thing? Nope. We're messed up. <laughs> Welcome to the chaos. Hello. I see somebody is with us. Stick around. We'll get ourselves together here while you're waiting on us to get ourselves pulled together. Um, you can get paper, something to draw with, color. Let me see if I can do this. So last week I was watching our video, just making sure everything was okay. Just kind of um scrutinizing a little bit and I'm like you know what if we just painted the stand green this is almost through um you wouldn't be able to see it and that turned into me getting some construction paper so we've kind of covered is that gonna work <laughs> it's okay we have more construction paper and tape oh Oh, we can still see it. So, um, yes. Follow for more tips on uh, green screen tech. <laughs> so grab some paper, something to Can color with and or paint with or draw with, whatever you want to do. And we're going to do a little art together when we pull ourselves together. Together. I know not. Well, this somehow worked. <laughs> hey, we have two comments. Hi. Oh, that no. Well, I, that, no. I'm not going to sit there. Hey, oh, you're having difficulties today. Phone isn't communicating with your TV. Well, welcome to the chaos. Just give us a few minutes. Um, my phone's going to die which means we won't have table cams, so I've got to figure out where to plug it in. So welcome, and um, I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm going to try to fix our issue that we are currently having. We just have to move the lights a little bit, and then I can use this. Well, that's not a problem at all. No, no, no. No, not at all. More paper. To cover up the tape. What? <laughs> the tape shows up. Oh. Don't mind the woman behind the curtain. Don't mind? Okay, I'll mind. <laughs> it doesn't mean don't sit too much. Just, she's not really there. <laughs> okay, I think we're about in business here. Boy, I was all set, and then I wasn't. Okay. This was a bit of a last minute idea. So if there you go, go down, you are just going to get your face cut off there. Scissors. Scissors. Scalpel. All right. <laughs> We're going to get started here. How are yeah. you? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Our amazing tech. Um, 
that we have going on. I'll allow you to see the entire shape. So, would you like to see? I'll turn the green screen um, magic off for just a second, and you can see what it actually looks like. What? <laughs> Let's see. Um, turn I have a green screen off. <laughs> so. You know, in movies, uh, you see like the green screen stuff. Well, this is our equivalent. Do we really need this to come out here? I'm going to cut a little bit off of this because it's going to cut my shoulder off. <laughs> there we go. And we don't need this either. <laughs> that looks really strange while <laughs> you're cutting it. Yeah, so I was watching our thing um, the other day, and I thought, boy, I wish that just didn't have to be there. I'm like, oh, well, we'll just make it green. We'll paint it green. It's quite well, seamless, actually. Oh, look I probably should paint it green one day. That would be perfect. Look then at we that. wouldn't have to deal with this. Yeah. All right, put us back on our nice wintry background. Um, <laughs> no, <laughs> that's not winter. Maybe we should have this, although it's not that cold out. Oh no, I have given Landon the power to change our background. There we go. No. Yes. As much as I would like to go to Paris, we're not going to Paris today. <laughs> All right, we need to get started. Wait, that, that was last week's. We have to have a different background so it's not confusing. There we go. Okay, I do need that. Oh. I know. So our background, let me just uh, talk about that for just a second. It's a wintry scene from Hawksai. So that is the gentleman that we, boy, my hair is really green today. That's a gentleman that we uh, talked about in our Japan box. Are you having fun? I'm going to see if I can do this. So this oh, is, no. oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, we don't need to do that. Okay. So this is the shape of our green screen. <laughs> yep. All right, so let's, I just have a couple announcements and then we will get started and then we'll get to doing some art. Oh, that changed the color. Okay, we have, let me take this off. Uh, our February sketching classes are available now for registration. Um, they will be held Friday mornings. Um, the, we have a sketching one class and a sketching two class. And um, yeah, they're open for registration. So let me show you what we get. You will get um, four classes for $40 for your whole household. So if you have several children, it's like a couple dollars a child per week. Um, the sketching one class, you will get handouts and I will teach your child how to sketch from life. So you gather some things from your household and um, we'll sketch some of the things that you have. You'll sketch things you have, I'll sketch things I have, and I'll give you a demonstration, and we'll um, just do that. And this is how you get to it. Go to kidsarttour.com, go to the shop. You can see there by the red arrow. And then scroll down in the shop till you find me sketching one and two classes. And you can find out the dates there are in the classes. Okay, we're gonna get started. You can see that, by the way. I know. <laughs> okay. I know, it looks like, wait, can, can you uh, full screen that? Oh. We can make things float. Um, it's out of the cradle. I know, I'm trying to get it back in. Uh, this is, is clearly me. falling apart here. We need tape stat. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ah. All right, and then we need to stop touching it. Okay. And by we. Wait, wait. There's a specific way I did that so the tape wouldn't show up.
So something weird happens every now and then, our computer just kicks us right out of the live stream. Okay, so we're back. Let's get started. And now I have to bring in my presentations again. I'm so sorry. This is crazy. All right. Okay, sketching class. Now, let's get started with what we were going to do today. Okay, we're doing winter themes, and we're going to do some artwork again. Last week, we um, drew some winter scenes. This week, we're going to talk about the animals that we see or don't see in the wintertime. So it changes depending on where you live. So we live in upstate New York, and we lose some animals, right? Either they migrate or they start to hibernate or bury and get into their dens. And if you're living in the South, you gain animals from the North, right? I don't know if you lose any animals in the South. If you are living in the South and you see fewer animals, um, thinking, you know, birds, squirrels, I don't know if you have any <laughs> foxes, white foxes um, around where you live, um, but we're going to talk about some specific animals. So just be thinking about what you're seeing right now. And is that an animal that you see all year round? So we get cardinals all year round. We get squirrels all year round. We do. I just saw a couple running by. And so they don't hibernate and they don't migrate. What else do we see? What else do we see in the wintertime? Do you not want to be on? <laughs> Landon's invisible. Landon's just about invisible with his greenish shirt. So, yeah, I'm going to go through and show you some pictures, actually, because I have some pictures of some animals. So we talked about the squirrels, <gasps> and they're incredibly cute, aren't they? And um, oh, so they run around. Get into your roofing. They do, and, yeah, they can be a nuisance, mm -hmm. but I like them. They're okay. I like chip chipmunks more, though. Yes. Yes, they're super cute. Then we have the cardinals, which we get. We have a cardinal family that lives in a tree behind our house. And we see Mr. and Mrs. Cardinal every now and then. And over springtime this past year, they had a baby. Oh. And so we got to see that baby. Um, we also get this guy, Dark Eyed Junko. We don't have him in the warm months. We have him in... Um, he comes in the fall and he sticks around through the winter time and then he goes away in the spring. Can I say something? Mm -hmm. That looks very photoshopped in. It kind of does. I was wondering about that. He looks a little too perfect there. Oh, well, that is still what he looks like. However, in person, I always thought he had a little yellow beak. So maybe the photos aren't quite. Or ours just have yellow beaks. So he's a cute little guy that shows up at certain times of the year. And My favorite. Yes, Landon's favorite is a chickadee. And they're quite uh, bold. Yeah. They don't scare easily. And as you can see, there's a picture there. You see someone's feeding them, uh, feeding the chickadee from their hand. It's somewhat easy, so I've heard and read. I've actually touched a chickadee mm -hmm. before. It's easy to train them to be able to do that. Um, I've been sitting on the porch and a chickadee will just come and be near me, maybe a yard away from me, eating from a feeder while I'm just sitting there. I think I was talking on the phone, actually, so it wasn't like I was being really quiet. Um, so I knew I was there. So they stick around for the winter time. Now, we don't have these around here, but so Let's cute. talk about all the animals. Yeah, we're going to create a winter scene with animals, uh, winter animals. Um, now, Lana, do you know about the winter fox? Does he change color in the winter? Okay, he turns white in the winter, so normally he wouldn't be the shade. And then they listen for rodents and creatures under the snow. And then you see this guy is doing his like little dive thing. That's what they do. They're like, dive down, and they get it. The poor creatures. <laughs> So I'd be digging deeper. Yeah. If I was one of them. Mm -hmm. It's it's harder in the winter. Um, I'm thinking birds have a harder time in the winter, which is why it is good to feed them during the winter time because they don't have the bugs. Um, berries are in short supply. Um, anything growing is not really so much. 
And a lot of animals do hibernate. If you're, you know, like the fox who eats other animals, it's hard to find. So all these changes happen. And then we oh. might have deer. Oh my goodness. I know, they're so gorgeous, aren't they? We have deer in our area, but not in our neighborhood. I wish, we... um, that's a moose back there. Oh yeah, you're right. You see the antlers back there. At least it looks like it. Although I don't know. That's def no, it's definitely a moose. It's not a, it's yeah. not a deer. No, it's not, they're connected. Yeah, so yeah, then there's moose. Can you think of any other animals, Landon? Um, I saw a picture of a, an owl, a snow owl. I'm trying to think of any other animals. Um, so we're gonna make a scene. We're gonna With make my scene. mom's green hair. With, oh, I know, I don't know why that's happening. So here's today's challenge. My hair isn't green. I don't know, did it last week too. Um, today's challenge, create a scene with winter animals. So you could do like a backyard scene. Um, you could have bird houses and ways that you could take care of the animals shown. Yeah, I'm probably going to have the cardinal because he doesn't really blend in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So squirrels, cardinals. We have a lot of rabbits in our yard or in our neighborhood, I mean. And um, they hibernate, actually. So... We don't see them during the winter. So if you want to do like a cutaway, like, oh, yeah. oh, you wanted to draw it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so if you had your scene and then you wanted to like have a cutaway and show what's under the ground, you can show those animals like sleeping or burrowing or something like that in their, their little sleepy place. You didn't talk about bears, bears hibernate. So if you live, wherever you live, you can comment and let us know where you live, like generally south, north. Um, what animals you see, what animals you stop seeing in the winter time. And if you don't see them anymore, you could draw them either. Well, if they migrate, you can't really. I guess you could. But um, if they hibernate but stay in your area, you can do like a cutaway and show them sleeping and snuggling. This is Spectacular picture. Spectacular. In just a minute, I'll get table cam going, and um, we'll just draw together. I'm going to take this down, Landon. Um, how about I pull up a picture over here for you? You're in Florida. Latoya, I grew up in South Florida. I grew up near Miami, Fort Lauderdale, Pompano Beach area. Where we're, well, if you don't want to say, that's fine. Um, so yeah, so you get some creatures from the north. I'm wondering if you maybe just get more of them or what happens. So we lost table cam and I don't know why. We may not have table cam today. <laughs> After all that, it is plugged in. Well, we'll just have to wait. So I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. I may do some cutaways because I like to show the animals in their burrows. Usually have bunnies, you haven't been seeing them. Hmm. Florida. Do you have a cat in your neighborhood? Yeah. <laughs> we have a cat. <sighs> we don't like them. Yeah. They, long story short. Yeah. We don't want to go into detail. The cat is not good for our bunnies, and that's what I'm gonna say about that. So our my phone wasn't plugged in the right way, so it died. So once it gets up, I'll put the table cam up, and then you can see what we're doing. Does this look okay now? Oh yeah, it looked okay before. All right, so you're in South Florida, Pompano Beach or Palm Beach? Oh, West Central. Here you go now. Okay, got it. Um, we also have goldfinches, and they kind of go away in the winter time. 
although I know that the males aren't as bright, so I might not um, be recognizing them, but I think they stick around till it's like dead of winter. And we also lose our butterflies. Although those, those are insects, we lose our bugs and bees and all that. I don't know I where they go. Will. Do they hibernate or do they migrate? Bees and bugs and things like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Clearly, I'm not a biologist that. or a scientist. <laughs> Lots of cardinals. Yeah. They make me happy. They have a very distinct sound. So, um, you know, when they're around. Look, Mom. Oh, I like that very much. Yeah. Let me pull up. I'm just going to pull up some pictures for Lana to look off of if you wanted to see that. Sorry for our craziness earlier. I thought we were all set. And then we weren't. Let's... There. Does that help, Lennon? Yes, that one. Okay. That is definitely photoshopped. Huh. Hmm. If you need me to cycle through some of the pictures, let me know. To get ideas. Yeah, Landon said one of these. The one cardinal one on the left there is He's photoshopped. Floating. I don't know. Just floating. It might just be an effect of the camera where the background is very blurry and it might just look. Maybe he just, he's touching one of his feet and the other one, he might have just done that to adjust. I don't know. Okay. My phone has power now, but it'll take a bit to get back in. He looks so cute. I like him very much. He's very cute. You can hold it up if you want. Ah, uh, and that's where table cam is needed because anything green goes away. So my mom is now invisible. <laughs> I need to see the screen real quick. Okay. I have to change so many things. Okay, there we are. Now we can see. There you go. Well, that took a long time to do. <laughs> now I can see Lana's drawing, and my masterpiece got started. That looks like <laughs> your previous one. It. Phone died again. We're just not going to have table cam today. I'm so sorry. I don't know what keeps happening. Table cam. Oh, tech is great till it's not great. So I did have something planned while you all drew. So I'm going to do that. We have some artwork to look at. So what I did, I pulled some artwork that uh, was posted when we did um, two live art tours ago. So two live art tours ago, we did a New Year's thing. Let me pull mine up. Or not, oh, there's mine. 
So we were going to do 2023. Oops, sorry, Landon. And make it, of course, mine's going to be see through. <laughs> you can see my 2023. Um, and we had it make it 3D. And then we added some some things to it, either what we wanted 2023 to be or um, just some things. Yeah, that, yeah. I just decorated or things about me that I would be doing or, and then for some reason I added a robot. I don't know. It was just a smattering of whatever we wanted to do. So we had a couple posted. So we're just going to look at those. This is Danica's and it's super cute. So I'm looking and seeing. So she's got sports on the three and the two. Is that an anime character? You have to help me, Landon. We don't know. So cute characters, some sports, some things that Danica likes to do um, that she's looking forward to doing in 2023. And then we had Demi. And she used words on hers. So we've got explore. I don't know what that says. Um, act and write and friends and art and walk swim and swim yes so this year and then she drew some little pictures to go along with it she likes to do art and acting and they both like to do drama and things like that so there's that and then landon had his he got the two and the zero and he was just done but um i really like your plants and your little aquarium there <laughs> it's really cute And then the next week, which is last week, we just did winter scenes. We looked at some winter paintings and we did some scenes. And so actually Landon started um, doing some animals before that, I mean, before this week. So you've got some little bunny rabbit tracks, right? And it goes into a den. And you had fun with shadows. I really like your shadows. Yeah. And then we have a couple more that were posted from last week. So this is Ella's. I love your snowman. He's super cute. And then we have clouds. And I'm thinking those are birds up top. And the little flowing creek. Oh, on your tree. My I little squirrel hole. I, oh, you see a squirrel? I didn't see that. A squirrel hole. Oh, a squirrel hole. Yes. So, yep, there's a place that animals can stay. What I was going to say, I see some little buds on your tree, Ella. I like that. That tells us that it's starting to warm up and we're gonna get leaves again on the trees and winter's almost over. And then this is Elisa's. Elise, I love um, some of the, it's like you, you put colors on top of each other and then they kind of mixed. I love that texture and that effect. So super cute. I'm guessing the snow, the green is your, sorry. The blue is your snow, and I like your tree. Very, very nice. And it looks like you drew an outline, kind of sketched out where you wanted the tree to go, and then you colored it in. I think that was really good planning. So if you would like to uh, have your work seen, even if you would not, you can. <laughs> well, I guess if you don't want it seen, let me know. I won't put it up here. But um, when people put their work on the live stream here as a comment. We can talk about it and I'll show it later, another week. Oh, <laughs> is that another woodland creature, Landon? It's a squirrel. Oh my goodness. I thought it, I thought it was BB-8. Can you see how I thought it was BB-8? No. No, <laughs> I saw the round and then the little head on top. And then there was an orange there. Yeah, my phone is not getting charged for some reason. So we'll have to hold our pictures up every now and then. How are you all doing? Good. You were doing goodly, goodly moodly. I see it now, Landon, but at first glance. <laughs> I'm going to... Put some bunnies down 
in there done. There's my squirrel. Aww, he's very cute. I was just about to put a bunch of leaves on my tree. What was I thinking? <laughs> Mine is an evergreen. And that's allowed. This is a perfect brown. Mm, it's like really dark. It's like dark chocolate brown. With a little bit of green. Just a second, I'll show you mine. My progress. It's not much. And I have a tree, and then I did a little, so the little den inside, um, those are bunnies. You can't tell because they're small, but they're bunnies. Landon's, like, got a lot more done than I do. I stole it just now. There. You could have left it open for me. <laughs> I'm so inconsiderate. And you need black? <laughs> you know, I think I'll use black for my whole picture. <laughs> hmm. You Bunny's know, that deer. Looks weird. What looks weird? That was supposed to be his eye. Oh, it looks like he he cried and <laughs> the tears are running down. That looks better. Oh, yeah. Cardinals always look so serious. Serious and beautiful at the same time. Regal. So I'm going to put my little dark eyed Junko in there somewhere. Oh, yeah. It's nice, huh? So there's Landon's squirrel, which does not look like BBA anymore. Definitely a squirrel. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking when I looked over, and I didn't know what you were thinking. <laughs> like, Landon, winter scene. It is confused. It really is confused. It is mother. You have all the grays over there. I'm gonna take one. Take it. It's so strange. We must have a little break down in the cord here. Tech people, come here. We need you. Mm -hmm. Come in. <laughs> no, <laughs> oh, don't reveal our secrets. <laughs> Let's do this. this <laughs> oh, yeah, not BG. Wasn't that one of the pictures I found that we used? I don't know who found it. We'll go with that. Bill. Oh, yeah. Me. Um, <laughs> you can stop that.
We're in France. I think this looks so We're funny. <laughs> it does. It does look strange. So let's get rid of that. No, put on the brick wall. <laughs> Your shirt is disappearing. Do the house one. The big yes. Oh yeah, this is so our house right now. Mm -hmm. Definitely our house. Yeah. With a floating blue sticky big piece of sticky tack on that It's on there. that big wall back there. It's like this big no. Yeah. Yeah. So how are you all doing with your winter scenes? Are you done, Landon? No. Okay. Hey. It's really nice. I like it. I like it. Don't touch it. Wow. Wow. Uh, phone good. You know what? If you, um, yeah, I don't think it will let you share during the live. You can share after, and um, then I'll grab it next week. Or if you want to just message me or email me the picture, any other way you want to get it to me. Yes. Page cool. Here. There. Yes. <laughs> so. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I think you have figured it out. It's a green marker. Oh, hey, we had somebody else. Did you come back after we <laughs> had our fiasco? We lost like two people while we were um, trying to fix the tech. So Landon's playing with the green screen feature. Um, oh, you are all done. I like this one. Keep it on this one. Okay. Okay. Yes, sir. You're Good all job. done. Wonderful. So, <laughs> all right. What else are you going to do on yours, Landon? I have a question. If your eyes are green and you're using green screen... <laughs> <laughs> what happens to your eyes? Okay. Okay. I'm going to do a couple things and then we are going to say goodbye. Not allowed. Allowed. No. Because they can't even see us drawing. They're just looking at us and it's boring. It might be. We're not as crazy to relax week. Hmm. Last week was awful. It was fun. But we just got in a, I don't know, silly juice. <laughs> we were so crazy. Okay. Give me back my brown. Your brown. Our, uh, they are actually nice. Yes, you're right. I'm ah. going to draw a fox. I'm just going to get as many animals in there as I can. What animals did you put in yours? Tell us. Oh. While Lena plays with the green things. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. I need to see that wolf picture again. Just for a second. Oh, you keep the chickadee up there? Good. Yeah. You want the chickadee? Mm -hmm. I want the chickadee. I'm going to draw chickadee. the wolf. Chickadee. The wolf. Chickadee. There are wolves. You could draw a wolf. This what I'm drawing is a fox. I'm draw, drawing the picture of him leaping. I'm doing a fox. Well, maybe they're friends. I should have done it on a lighter gray. Oops, sorry. Go away. Aww. Oh, you're doing that thing. 
So we started last week drawing things, drawing parts of things that were white in the snow and seeing how little you, little information you can give, um, but that you could still see what it was. You want to show that? Since we, can, can you, would you? Would you, would you? So Lana's drawing a white fox in the snow, but your brain can fill in the shapes um, look at his head and his body. Yeah. My, my fox is done. And he's so cute. I like him. That was a quick fox. Yeah. Yay. 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 I think the chickadee would be hard to do. How would you do a chickadee? Uh, camouflaging with the snow. No, just <laughs> yeah. It's a black cat chickadee. My favorite species. He's really big, much bigger than the cardinal. The even? cardinal, which is not, not accurate. No, yeah. Uh, I think you need some help there. No? I do need some help. I was gonna grab the book. Thank you. So I have my three birds. Now I don't think blue jays migrate, but I haven't seen any this year. So my three little birds are up in the tree. We have a chickadee. Ooh, where are you? Chickadee Cardinal <laughs> and the Dark Eyed Junko. I love your fox. Oh, thank you. Lana, we have a request. Can you show your picture one more time? How about I turn green screen off just for a second so that you can actually really see it? There. Yeah. I like your squirrel. Well, I like them all three. Nice. And it's like they all came up for the picture. <laughs> Squirrel came out of his little hole. Hi. And everyone's looking. Yeah. Let's hide this again. I almost forgot. Landon wanted the house. And then you're fading. Oh no. Oh no. You just see the face of a deer. Oh dear. Oh, yeah. I did look up some pictures of dens. And they do make like little mounds on the ground with a little hole. And then they go down. Looks like he's going. <laughs> what? My my dear. <laughs> I, it looks like he has to was, go to the bathroom. It's his front feet. The deer I was drawing has like it's where his neck attaches to his body, and it's like a little V there a he little has to bit. Go to the bathroom. And then when I put it in, it looks like he's going. <laughs> Maybe I'll just color it in. He has to go to the bathroom. No. Yes, he does. Not anymore. Aww. I got rid of it. I just, I think I'll just do all these features darker. Looks like. The fox looks so happy. Yeah. I should draw the mouse down below. It's like running oh, away no. in terror. No. No? Okay. Never mind. Lane said no. And plus I was talking about my fox. Oh. Well, I agree. Your fox is incredibly cute. No, happy. He was happy. He did say happy. I was drawing, so my brain was somewhere else. All right, so I fixed him. Although he <laughs> looks like he's just. Can I see? Oh, oh, see, oh like, see. He's like creeping. Like oh, it looks like <laughs> a human deer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> how can I fix this deer? There, I'll draw. I'll draw him from the side. 
doesn't work. No, no, wait. Let me try. Let me try. Let me try. <laughs> I think. I think I. I think I messed him up. Well, I want. I didn't feel comfortable drawing his whole body and his legs, so I put him like behind the hill. But that just made him look really creepy. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> okay, we're gonna move along. <laughs> are you done with yours? No. What else are you gonna do? Okay, do it. I don't know where though. Yeah. Um. Give me my brown. I keep stealing your colors. I need to see the chickadee. Okay. Hey, can I see the chickadee, please? Yes, you can. I need to see the. Chickadee. Landon, I don't want you to panic, but half your skull is gone. <laughs> so we have two people. I don't know if you've been here the whole time or not, but <laughs> we lost our table cam today. Uh, so we're doing winter scenes with winter animals and we were talking about how certain animals go away just like people leave the live stream just now <laughs> and then certain animals come <laughs> to us wherever you are so discussing all of that and we're doing winter scenes with animals showing them out and about or burrowed and in their dens Ah, his feet are cute what you can see of them. Yeah. Get to your feet. Mm -hmm. I use this peachy color for his soft brown. Didn't really work for you. It worked for me. That's that right there. Ah, yes. Hmm. What do snakes do in the winter time? I guess they hibernate. Kind of. Not like they sleep all the time, but a lot of animals just go underground and rest, hide out. Is my chickadee. So you did the same thing as you did with your fox. Mm -hmm. Where he's white, he is not there. Not there. You can see him. <laughs> so backwards. There, this chickadee. Cute. My mom is invisible. Invis. Oh. Oh. Ah. <laughs> so I think we're going to say goodbye. <laughs> Landon. Landon is fading away from us. My nose is gone. That's a problem. We're not okay. No, so no, we're not. I lost an eye. So we're gonna head out. Um, thank Bye. you for joining us. Bye. And we had a lot of fun. And just a reminder, those sketching courses are available now for registration if you would like to join us. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> have a good rest of your week. Oh, have a good weekend. We're just falling apart today. Maybe next week we'll have it all together. Have a good weekend and we'll see you next week. <laughs> <I know. laughs> Bye.